Hey everyone, it's your favorite housewife, Izzy. I want to give a shout out to my outfit, first and foremost, because it needs a shout out, Gucci from Wish. Like when you wear something like this, you need to stop and take a moment to take it all in, so I'm gonna give you guys that moment. Now I'm gonna give you a second to subscribe, hit that subscribe button, make sure you're liking this. And now we're ready to go. Oh, Lord. I went out in New York City and I lost my camera. I located it and then I had to piece the night back together. So let's let's talk about what happened. Um, as you guys know, I'm a rich housewife, so I always go to the finest places in New York and I always act as appropriate as possible as, you know, a rich housewife in New York City living this lifestyle. But this night didn't quite go like that. Guys, I'm going out to dinner. This is my outfit. It's looking a little witchy. These glasses are giving Valentine's Day vibes. I'm actually not going to wear them. I just put them on for fun. I woke up on Sunday morning and I opened up my handbag and the remnants of what was in my handbag were a lot less than what I brought out with me on Saturday night. Uh, the remnants of my sobriety were also not there. I was so sick. I was literally the sickest I've been since I had to get that IV in Mexico, remember? We're kind of hungover and this is Dr. Alex. He's gonna rescue us because <laughs> we're dying. You're not hungover? Me? Yeah. I'm dying, but you know what? I'm younger than you. You are substantially younger than me. I wake up Sunday morning, I open up my purse, and my camera is missing. And I don't remember a few parts of Saturday night. Let's see how the evening started. Now that looked quite civilized, right? We went to dinner, we had an amazing dinner. It was two glasses of wine and one martini. After dinner, Uncle Maurice and I decided to go to this piano bar. Let's just say the guy shouldn't have been singing. He should have just left it in the piano. Watch this. Thank you. Where do we go? Thank you. Now I want to point out that I think the sugar daddy is sending me a message through this piano bar. I'm going to take a side track here and let you guys know that I might be doing a yacht trip in Greece this summer. Make sure you subscribe so you catch that. But when I heard that Titanic song come on, I feel like he was sending me a subliminal message because you know, he got the life insurance on me. So I think, you know, I don't know if he's sending me a message that like my heart will go on, but my life won't because he'll be collecting my life insurance. Like I'm not quite sure what was going on there, but we're gonna, that, that is for another episode. Right now we're talking about Saturday night. Any whom, from there we went to this lovely gentleman's club. When I say gentlemen, I don't mean like, take your clothes off gentlemen. I mean like there were only gentlemen and no ladies. A gay club, we went to a gay club, a homosexual, club in my new neighborhood, Hell's Kitchen, which has many homosexuals. So at that point, I was like, two glasses of wine, one martini, one frozen drink, and three margaritas in. And um, we met these guys, obviously gay, at a gay club, and they were super cute. And they were like, let's go dancing. And so let's keep counting. Two glasses of wine, one mar martini, oh, one espresso martini, one frosé, and three margaritas later, here I am dancing with these boys till 2.30 in the morning. I am just too old to be out that late. Like, it's just, it's not, it's not the same when you're as old as me. I was probably the oldest person in the room. I'm having like a dilemma, I don't know what to do, but we need to get a taxi and I'm stuck. I need to get a taxi to 11th Avenue because you know I'm not walking to 11th Avenue because you know what happens there, crack. Right there, he's the, oh no, he's not open. Watch out for the bikes. It's all gonna go downhill from here morning, you guys. I'm on a line at a club where they're gonna charge me a cover. It's so cute. Where's they gonna charge me a cover? I'm gonna be a cover. 
I am so old, but I'm gonna like pay the cover. I'm feeling youthful right now. <laughs> I do want to point out there is nothing like going to a gay club because it is just good looking men all over the place. And like, it's just amazing. I didn't see any of the other housewives there. I don't feel like it was really their environment. I don't know why. They were probably at like Casa Cipriani's or Bon Zero or somewhere that I would never step foot in because it's boring. But I woke up hungover and I wanted to die. And, and these are nights in New York that I will never forget. I, I definitely want to do them every week. That's all I have to say. I mean, the hangover was worth it. I wanted to die the next day. Like, am I the only one who wakes up with a hangover? You guys need to let me know. Like, when did these hangovers get so bad? I'm so confused. All right, well, I will see you next Saturday night. I'll be doing this all over again. I'm going to be making a habit of going out and getting belligerent and toxic every Saturday. I love that for my journey. Stay toxic, my friends. The closet changes, this is what I ended up wearing. I'm kind of having a breakdown. I'm really, really late. I hate being late if you know me. My shorts are kind of tight. I hate being not dressed properly. I'm kind of not happy. It's Bestie's birthday and we have just made up and I'm gonna do my best to have the best time. Even though I'm just like, tomorrow I'm gonna do a major closet haul and anything I haven't worn in like, 18 months I'm getting rid of because I'm just like pulling shit out because it's there and I don't even really want to wear it anyway. Look at my hair, what is going on? The best coasters I- I got I, them at the standard. Did you, you yes. stole like them the from the standard? No, no, oh, I got them. I would have stolen them. These are the best coasters I've ever seen. Right, I had to get them. Oh, sorry, are you talking? It's okay, no, I'm not putting your face. Nobody wants to see your face anyway, they only want to see mine. She's too skinny. I know I'm too skinny now, I don't want to have like haters. Cheers. Liquor I found at the restaurant. Happy New Year! It's March. I'm So hungover, I walked into this place for a beer because I want to die. Let me look tonight when I sober up. Let me look tonight when I sober up, and I'm going to send you options based on location that is good for all of us in the same venue. I'm just not um, in a condition to do that at this exact moment. I don't know if you see what's going on here. Did you drink? That is it, guys. I went out. I've been hungover all day. I rallied. Now we are in an Uber. Let's get back to Manhattan, and I'll see you next week. Stay toxic, my friends. Hey everyone, it's your favorite housewife, Izzy. Don't forget to subscribe.